care about too much. I know you must say it's too much. It's fat. It's fat. Hey, yeah. Ella, your hair looks like a rubo hair. This is a old woman hair. <laughs> what do you want to tell her? Eh? Ella says like a rubo hair. Now all these old women that say purple crazy. Good morning, guys. So. Today is Saturday and I'm frying black hair. So I asked someone to come very early this morning to make their hair because if you've been <laughs> watching my videos, you know that Ella's hair is low. I cut it when she was one year plus, but that wasn't the intention. I didn't plan to cut it. I didn't want to. Go with the regular notion that one year old should always cut her hair. So I decided to keep the hair, you know, and the hair was doing fine earlier on, but once she clocked about nine months or so, the hair just started growing. Just started growing very unevenly. The back was very short, the middle was slightly longer than the back and then the front was long so I was really really trying not to cut it and I remember when I was telling my mom that I was going to keep the hair she said she pressed me and she was like once I bring them to her house for the holiday that she would take a lot to go and cut her hair but I'm sure she was joking she got to be joking anyway she finally cut the hair at about one year and I think three months or so I'm not even sure so the hair has been short and I'm always thinking of how to manage her hair. My focus. So I'm always thinking of how to manage her hair and all that. So my mom, you know, had talked her hair a few days ago. I was like, the hair will be able to make it So I called, there's a woman that stays near my mom's house that makes my hair. So I asked her to come very early this morning. And she came this morning, she made all their hairs. What are you doing in the kitchen? Out. That's the hair. Usually this style helps their hair grow fuller. And you can see I not get edges. No get edges. Today's Friday and I don't really like Fridays because Fridays are like half day. So I don't know, I, I just don't like Fridays. But um tomorrow is Grace's birthday and she's going to the six, the big six, a big six. And it's like I'm just thinking like was it six years ago I had her such a long time? That means if I had had Ella like almost immediately after Ella would be like four you know be a little bit grown and stuff but anyway we're so happy that you know god has kept her to this point very she's a very healthy child very active very strong and it wears me out honestly i'm in the kids room now i just want to bring out what ella and vicky would wear because we are going to the mall we want to buy a cake for grace she's not home now she's gone to school so she's going to close really early i think by two and right now it's 9.30, I just fed Ella, so I want to... Ella! Ella! She's not wearing diaper and I don't like to leave her alone because I feel like she's just going to pee and start walking around in the pee because I want to bat her, so I need her to be here. Ella! So yeah, I want to buy a cake and then buy ingredients for like fried rice, just to make fried rice. But not having people over, honestly, just my mom and maybe my sister. Because I want to sit down and eat cake. Like, I really want to eat cake. I have a bad, bad case of a sweet tooth. So, that's why I'm like, I'm sure I would have been an extra <laughs> yummy mom if I didn't have a sweet tooth. Because breastfeeding really helps me trend down after I give birth. But it's like, I'm, I'm losing one and then I'm gaining a hundred by eating so much. So, if I didn't eat this much, I probably would have been a lot slimmer than I am. But I just can't help it anyway. 
I was going to buy a for her tomorrow, today, sorry. So I'm waiting for my husband to come back. I want to quickly bath two of them and have my bath. I'm not going to wear it, of course, because you can see the weather is so bright. It's very, very sunny right now. And I'm really loving how bright I'm looking. So let me quickly get out something for her to them to wear. And I'll catch up with you guys. It is 11 30 to 12 actually and i have a mask on um i got the mask today at shop right i've been looking for it the last time it was the scrub i got so when i went there today they had the mask so i got the mask and it's been on for like two hours i had the mask on and then i started doing other things i'm about to have my bath i just finished blowing up balloons just to you know decorate the house just a bit so it looks like something is going on let me show you guys so just put some balloons down there yeah so um her daddy came back with a gift for her which was very sweet like i didn't even expect it because we already got something for her earlier on but he came back with like two package gifts and i think that was just really really sweet you know I'm jealous honestly I was looking for the happy birthday banner thing I couldn't find it but tomorrow morning I'm going to just try it so that I will still look for a few things just to use to decorate this place a bit because we're having children over so just a few things sure yeah. maybe the happy birthday banner basically I think that's really all I want to get then yes yeah, something like a wrapping paper type thing that I can put on the table when I'm going to put her cake just want to take a picture of it but really that is oh so let me go have my bath i want to sleep i really wanted to watch this is us this night but i'm so tired i need to go and sleep i'm so tired and i have a banging banging headache and ella will soon wake up now to breastfeed like good night happy happy birthday what's your presents happy happy thank birthday thank you so much mommy we open the mess. I don't even know it was the first time. Because you are very dear.
don't tear it you don't tear it when you're opening gifts you're careful about the box all you need to do is do this pull the bottom out you don't tear it because this is where you're going to keep it Daddy too, I just am on. Can you leave my yam? What's it? What? What's one to eat yam? You had breakfast now, free my food now. What is it? Bless it. Don't sneeze in my food. Ha! Leave my foot alone! Leave my foot alone! Vicky, let me breastfeed you. Sister Grace, eat your food. Oh yeah, can start singing. Was there nobody that on this? Oh, yeah. Is it right? 
Oh yeah, it's every day soon lose. <laughs> Is that how angry you are? Hey. <laughs> oh yeah, that's all. Hey, hey. I'm already seeing my best dancer. Oh. What them made their own guys there? Boys, the, the well, David and the uh, uh, Samuel. Uh, him and uh, yeah, so. Uh, are you funny now? Today is Sunday and it's the day after Grace's birthday. This day was so stressful. I have never cooked that quantity of rice before, but the rice was delicious. Like everybody just loved it. It's just that the type of rice my husband bought, I don't really like those small grain rice that uh, cook very fast. And because it cooked very fast, I didn't even know. Like I left the rice in normal time i would usually leave my rice when i want to parboil it and then the rice was already cooked like it wasn't even parboiled it just it cooked already so when i was trying to eat for the fried rice i just had to be really really quick with stirring it and you know taking it off the fire so that it doesn't become mushy and i now notice that even the ingredients under the pot self my spoon did not even get there so there's like it's like only fried ingredients under the pot but the rice was really 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 delicious the children had a nice time it's just that I was so tired. Like I almost did not have my party yesterday, but I had to. I was so tired. I was in the sister room. I was trying to send pictures. I was trying to post pictures on Facebook. I was like, so that I post them on her birthday, you know. So I was trying to send them from my camera to my phone, and I was sleeping. Like I was nodding. My husband was already snoring anyway, but I was just nodding in between. But I still did it before it was two o'clock. So Facebook can remind me next year. So yeah, and you guys, my gas finished yesterday. Can you imagine? As in, I blended tomatoes and pepper. I wanted to try them. And you know, I cooked a very huge pot of rice, but the chicken I fried wasn't enough to like match the rice. Because I was like, today I'll still cook some and fry some. But I had some guests that asked me for food for the second time, and I was like, I'm sorry, there's no chicken. And I even had people that came in very late, like my neighbors came in like by past seven. I didn't expect them again. There was no chicken to give them. I told them that, you know, there was just rice, no chicken. And at some point, I said, let me even boil some chicken and then fry. And I turned on my gas and my gas was finished. And the boy that brings gas to us, his phone got stolen, so we weren't even able to reach him. So right now, we're just sitting here. There's no gas. My husband has gone out. I don't know if he's going to look for gas. And today's Sunday. I don't know if he's going to look for gas. He's going to look for the boy. But I just this is supposed to be a chill day. I'm just hoping it's really as chill as I want it to be. So we'll see you guys.